Assalamu alaikum everyone. This is Naz with Hijab and You with another tutorial. How are you doing this morning? I hope inshallah you're doing okay. Staying safe. It's a horrible time. But we must get through this. And how we get through it is what we do. And how we take care of ourselves. And how we take care of our families. And try to help everyone else around us. We must do our bit. I know I sound like a broken record and every day and every time I make a video and I do a tutorial, I tell you the same thing. But it's because we care. And because we care for each one of you and because we want every one of us to get through this together and be safe. And that is the only reason why I say this all the time. Anyway, today's tutorial is about this beautiful look. Look at how gorgeous that is. Isn't that beautiful? It's a beautiful scarf. It's a rectangular scarf. And I've wrapped it a little bit differently. I haven't used any pins as of right now. Um, but just to show you what the options are, you can use a pin, you can pin it here, or you can just wrap it without the pin. The fabric is 100% polyester. But it's a beautiful, beautiful scarf. It's gorgeous. It's got tassels on both ends. And this is why I've left it hanging in the front. So you can see that it is gorgeous. It gives you full coverage. It wraps nicely and it just sits there. It's gorgeous. The, the color is vibrant. It's, I love when I put my hijab on. I feel good about it. And this is beautiful we can take a regular hijab wrap it nicely and it will still look beautiful it's coming from the heart and how you feel about it now it's quick and easy i want to show you how i did it and if i can i pos probably put in another way of wrapping the scarf so we can have two options of wearing the same scarf and it's just simple and easy and quick it's very quick and that's my intention for you my viewers you're precious to me and i want you to stay with me and i want you to keep watching and i want to make this wearing hijab so easy for each and every one of you uh, some of us have difficulties with it some of us are pros at it and i'm not a professional at all in any way i just love wearing my hijab and i love styling it up and i may not be the best at it but i'm trying to show my viewers you guys how we can do this together and if you have any suggestions please do leave a comment in the bottom and i will address it or if you have a suggestion to you know make do i'm, I'm open to all of that we're here to build this together and um so i just want to make sure that we are doing this together and that uh you know we help each other out i'm here to help you and i can take help in any way possible listen we're hijabis we want to be beautiful respectful, elegant looking, gorgeous looking hijabis. You know, we are all from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. He's our creator. He's created us. We had no choice in this creation. Um, what we do with it is what's important. And we are hijabis and we want to make it look respectful and beautiful. And that's the intention. So quickly, I'll show you how I got this look. And it's very simple, very easy, and it doesn't take very much at all. And this is a rectangular scarf that I'm wearing today. It's polyester. It's the fabric is beautiful. I just want to show you that. It's beautiful. It's got tassels on the end. And it's got a really nice print on it. And today I've got my ninja on. It's nicely tucked in. It covers everywhere. There's nothing showing in the back. There's no skin showing. And then I've put a cap on, a really nice cap. It's got a crisscross in the front. It's very, 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 it's not very visible, the crisscross, but it is there. And it's so subtle, so subtle. Love it. And now this makes the fabric that I'm using, it really, it sticks together so nicely, so it doesn't move at all. See that? Okay, so now let's attempt to get this done really quickly. It's pretty scarf. Oh, I love it. It's so beautiful. 
And basically all we've done is we are going to leave it one side short, one side. It's, it's a pretty wide scarf, not even wide, it's also a long scarf. So it gives you a lot of room to work with. And we're just going to fold this over here. Put some pressure, just some pressure. There's no need today. The fabric is so nice. We can bring it down a bit have that little nice and we're doing it putting some pressure here because this first look we have no pins on so all we're doing is putting a little bit of pressure and folding this over so easy and so simple and so beautiful see that the fabric just sits there nicely it sits exactly how you put it you don't have to have too much fussing about it you just fuss with it to get all the pleats looking really nice and presentable and making sure the back is covered and this here like i said this look here has no pins and with the fabric the kind of fabric it is it really really doesn't need any pin. It just falls so nicely. See what I've done there? See what I've done? And this here, I'm going to bring it under here. I can tuck it in my blouse and it's gonna have a nice flow in the front. And we've got full coverage. The tassels are showing. It's so pretty. And you just fix it up a bit so that it looks nice and even across. So, you know, on one side, it's not too much on the other side. So we just fix it up. It looks pretty. We've got a nice little like that. See, a lot of the young girls like that these days. But any one of us can wear it. I mean, I'm, I like it too. And it's okay. How was that? How easy was that? See how easy that was? Here it is. We've got the full coverage. We've got no pins on today. And I'll just show you the back how it looks. See the length that is? See how it falls on both sides? Really pretty. And you've got that. And I think that's gorgeous. Look at it. It's so pretty. I have no pins on. Now, if you would like to be comfortable, you like your pins in, in place like I do, I would put two pins here just to keep it in place. One, you're not taking away the nice flowy look. You're just putting the pin to keep it from falling over if you're going out and it gets windy. But you're not doing it too tightly. You're just putting the pins in place to keep the hijab from flying. You know, if, if it's windy outside, and you don't want to be fussing with it now that's a still a really nice flowy look and no pins i put two segment on there only because i'm showing you the options that you are, you can have and this is gorgeous 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 the fabric is beautiful the look is beautiful the fall is beautiful the way it sits is so pretty and it's just a very simple 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 look we've taken the shorter side and that's on the left hand side and we've let on the right hand side we had the longer side of, of the scarf and all we've done is put a little bit of pressure and fold it over put the few like give it a few little depends on how much how much you want to do there see see how nice that falls depends on how much you want to do you can fold it up give it some pleats and then it folds nicely. I think that's gorgeous. I hope you like that because I enjoy showing it to you and I enjoy making it easy for you and showing you how easy it is to wrap this scarf. It's pretty. Now we can use the same scarf, okay? And we can, let's take those pins out and I'll show you. 
I mean, we can do two or three different options with this. Similar, we're gonna keep that there. We're gonna fold it over here. And when I fold the hijab over, I always put my hand here to give it some room because you don't want it to be tight when you're, you don't want it too tight on your neck. You want comfort. That's it so prettily. fabric is easy to work with I mean you can use any hijab and make the same style and it would work for you and there you go we've got it a different look again same scarf same scarf a different look take a look at the back how great beautiful it is okay. we can also give that a knot here if we like These are just different options. I wouldn't give it two knots just to give it that nice flow. I'm going to give it just one knot and put it over here and make sure that my folds are nice again. And you've got a different look altogether same scarf a bit of just a little bit of variance and you can get a different look that's all that it is instead of leaving it hanging all we've done is give it one knot how is that that's beautiful isn't it now again if you want you know if you feel a lot more comfortable you can put two pins there if you don't want if you feel comfortable like that which this look is beautiful like that and this, the fabric, it all depends on the fabric. Some fabric will not sit without the pin. This one here definitely sits without the pin. You don't have to worry about it. You can leave it without the pin and just wrap it and give it a knot here and you're ready to go. Isn't that beautiful? Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay, so let's take the same scarf and I'll just show you using the same scarf. Now we're going to use some pins and really make this a beautiful wrap we're not gonna have any we're gonna use like that I'm gonna put a pin here this is your usual regular wrap but because it's such a pretty scarf I, I need to show you the options of how you can use it and everyone is so different everyone likes different things like it different ways and this is majority of us like this simple wrap pull it across now this side was shorter just gonna leave that there for now and we're gonna pull us over i'm gonna give it a pin here because right now what we're going what we're doing is we're making it giving it that really pretty pretty wrap look full coverage in front I'm using the same scarf and I'm going to bring that up here fold it in just fold it in a tiny bit so the ends are really nice and neat and I'm going to use one of these thick pins my secret is to Try to get it onto the strap. Now we've got that done. That's in place. And we're going to use two little stick pins here. These are the smaller ones. beautiful so far it's gorgeous it's easy it's not difficult whatsoever the 
just making sure they're even they look even when you put it on you look at it it should be even and here you have a really nice wrap with it flowing in front with full coverage it's really pretty it's got full coverage and in the back we've got really really pretty foil in the back look at that how gorgeous is that it's so pretty so beautiful so you've got full coverage in front full coverage in the back and you've got it flowing really nicely did you like that do you like that i like it i think it's pretty it's so neat and so beautiful and just simple all we did was we put the scarf on the head one side on your left side was shorter on the right side longer we pinned it here fold it pin it and then we wrapped it across with one pin here and this it's nice and hanging it's beautiful really really beautiful flowing and we've put two stick pins in here to give it comfort so that it's not moving and you're not fussing with it and that's it i put a pin here to hold the front so we have really nice coverage in front and you've got full coverage and basically that is the look i think that was quite easy if you're finding it difficult reach out to me let me know what you're finding it difficult with and i will try and help you with it and that is beautiful 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 see i've used one scarf and a few different ways of which we can wrap it and, and uh, tie it up and you know we made a one with the um the bow here the wrap it's beautiful 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 i hope you enjoy that really i hope you did and if you have any questions please reach out to me now please do stay safe take care of yourselves take care of yourselves your family and do whatever it takes to keep you and all of them safe until we meet again this is naz saying assalamu alaikum and take care.